Captain, what is it you're doing here? So we've, we've come for two main reasons. Uh, the first was to uh, conduct the media launch for Port Rush Airwaves, so for the air show later in the summer. And we've just been up to Port Rush and did a couple of fly pass and had some uh, photographers up there. And then we're here at Aldergrove for the next couple of days supporting the ADS event, uh, plugging into Northern Ireland's aerospace and defence industry and also doing uh, some engagement with the reserves. So hopefully the jet noise around the province has helped raise the profile of the Royal Air Force, remind those in Northern Ireland that there is a Royal Air Force out there um, and that there is a reserve squadron here that everybody's welcome to join. I can see you're a local man, what's it like flying in over the province? It's nice. It's much greener here than on the mainland. Fantastic. And I always notice that every time I come. So I've brought jets here many times. And uh, it's always nice to be back in the homeland. Wing Commander James Armstrong, Officer Commanding 502 Ulster Squadron. RAF Reserves. Okay, Wing Commander, um, how important is the meeting of the ADS group on the premises today? Uh, 502 hosting uh, this major business forum is important because we're part of the community here in Northern Ireland and recruit from it and uh, the skills we can develop in our reserves will help this business community. So you see this as very much a, a cooperative uh, initiative between yourselves and the rest of the local business and national business community? Very much so. Now, the air defence and security industry obviously are our natural uh, place to rest ourselves and you know, we work closely with them. You know, we've got a tornado jet in here today. That has been developed with the business community, you know, and not just British Aerospace, there is a whole ream of British industry that work together to form that aircraft and then we work to keep it in the air. If anybody is actually interested in joining the RAF Reserve, how would they go about doing it? Um, look up our webpage, RAF Reserves, put it in your search engine um, and you will find us and then follow the instructions. There's a call centre where you can get you know, through to, but they will also put you here in the Northern Ireland Squadron 502 Ulster Squadron. What type of occupations are actually available? There's a mixture of technician roles, um, intelligence, uh, police, RAF police, um, you know, a whole range of things from a chef to keep us fed and watered, flight ops, making sure the aircraft go to the right places in the, you know, with the right equipment, right maps, and make sure all the air corridors are covered. You know, you, there's 14 different uh, trades on 502 Ulster Squadron. 